Live from Sparkles Clubhouse, here are your hosts for Sparkle Safety Spot, Firefighter Dana and the Fire Safety Dogs. Well, good morning, everyone, and welcome to this 136th edition of Sparkle Safety Spot. I am your host, Dana Hilton, along with my good friend, Molly, the Fire Safety Dog. Now, Molly is a Dalmatian. She is one year and nine months old, and she helps me teach fire safety. So we're really excited to be here, whether you are watching the recorded version or the live stream we are really glad we're here. you're here, aren't we, Molly? First of all, Molly just got in from playing. She had a huge drink of water, but she played so hard outside, didn't you, Molly? <laughs> she had a great time. All right, Molly, you want to wave at the boys and girls? Can you wave? Let's wave. Can you talk? Say hi. Good morning. Say good morning. Talk. Molly, can you talk? Say hi. Tell everybody hi. Say hi. Talk. You can do it. You can do it. Say good morning. <laughs> there you go. So she says good morning. Well, today we have a very exciting show. We have firefighter Bo Hagar from the Little Rock Fire Department. He has with him today, he has Chief Bob Huntrup of the Little Rock Fire Department. He's a chief of training. They have a very special video to show you today. We are so excited and we can't wait for that. So let's go ahead and see what Molly has been up to this week. All sorts of really cool stuff. Now, Molly is still, um, you could still vote for Molly for the Hero Dog Awards. She is up for the Emerging Hero Dog category, and she would love to have your vote. Just go to herodog.org and cast your vote for Molly. You can do this once a day until June the 6th, right, Molly? And she would love to have your vote. All right. Well, earlier we just got through Skyping with some boys and girls from Austin, Texas, from St. Gabriel's, and here they are. A whole classroom of junior kindergartners. So we got to visit with them, share some fire safety tips, read our fire safety book. And we had a really good time, didn't we, Molly? Did we have a good time? Yes, we did. It was a very good time. We had time before the show to take a selfie. <laughs> let's see what else we have going on. Wait, Molly. Oh, let's see. What do we have? Oh, this is really cool. Now, Molly now knows 69 tricks. This is something. This is her 69th trick that she did yesterday. See this door? I'm on one side and she's on the other. And Molly, since she's a dog and doesn't have hands, can't turn the handle. So on the other side of this door, I took a rope and hung it down. And watch what Molly does. Are you ready, boys and girls? Here we go. House, that when the door closes, Molly can't get through. So I put a rope on the other side. Watch what Molly, happens. Can you pull? Pull. She's on the other side. What do you think she's going to do? You did it. Come here. Come here. <laughs> she did it. I was so proud of you, Molly. You did an amazing job. Yes, you did. Boy, you played really hard, didn't you? One of the things that Molly likes to do a lot is she likes to play. And she likes to play hide-and-go-seek. So here she is playing hide-and-go-seek. Do you see her? Look real close. Can you see her? There she is playing hide-and-go-seek. You're so silly. Now, boys and girls, Dalmatians have spots and they can have either black spots or brown spots. But what's really cool, I took a picture of this of Molly's paw while she was sleeping. She has a spot on her paw. Don't you, Molly? 
and she has a really special spot right above her eyebrow. So, oh, and this week Molly went to the fire station. She had her picture made on the fire truck. Didn't you, Molly? And she watched a little, a little bit of hydrant tra training. There she is. So she had a really big week. Now we're going to go ahead and send this over to Chief Bob Hunter and to Chief, uh, sorry, almost gave you a promotion, Bo, and to Firefighter Bo Hagar from the Little, Little Rock Fire Department. Hi, my name is Bob Hunter, Chief of Training for the Little Rock Fire Department. We're out here today uh, doing some uh, ladder training with the truck companies uh, during our EMT refresher class. Uh, what they're doing is we, if we're simulating if we had a patient up on the roof and we had to bring him down. So we have all Little Rock firefighters are also emergency medical technicians. They're doing a patient assessment, taking care of the uh, simulated victim, and then they're putting them in a basket, and then they're the uh, ladder truck crew is lowering them down the ladder to safety down here on the ground. And while all the while that they're on the ladder, we're monitoring their vital signs and we're taking care of them, all their medical needs, and we're safely lowering them down to the ground. And, and we would do this, and this is simulating if you had a worker or a person trapped up on the roof that was having a medical emergency, and they couldn't come down the stairs or they really couldn't take them down an elevator. The only way down would be down the ladder truck. Chief Hunter, thanks for joining us today on the Safety Spot. We really appreciate you showing us what you have going on at the training center here in Little Rock. Um, that's it for us today. Uh, children, I want to leave you with a safety tip. Uh, make sure you always buckle your seat belts anytime you're inside of a moving vehicle. And make sure your parents always pull to the right for sirens and lights. All right, we'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Thank you so very much, Chief Hunter, and thank you so much firefighter Bo. We had a great time watching that video and boys and girls, we hope that you had a great time too. Well, what's nice about the Little Rock Fire Department is they have really wanted to help with Sparkle Safety Spot and with the Keep Kids Fire Safe Foundation. Molly is an honorary fire marshal for the city of Little Rock and she is wearing her special Little Rock fire vest today and this spring and this summer boys and girls we are going to have so much fun. Molly and I are going to be going to the Little Rock fire department in Little Rock making lots of videos this spring and this summer. We're going to have some very exciting things. Now next week firefighter Bo is going to be talking about water rescue. Yesterday the firefighters at the Little Rock fire department had a water water rescue training exercise so he got some great video of that and some wonderful pictures and we're going to be talking about that next week so we're really really looking forward to that <laughs> there we go now if you would like you're welcome to join molly on facebook just go to facebook.com forward slash molly the fire safety dog she would love to be your friend she has boys and girls let me show you this picture here molly let me see if i can find this picture for the boys and girls let me show you how many friends she has. She is so excited about this, aren't you? So excited. Gotta find it. Here we go. Look at that big number. 2,400 likes on her Facebook page. That is a lot of friends, isn't it, Molly? She loves having friends. She would love for you to join her page. If you'd like to send mail to Molly, you can send it to her at Molly the Fire Safety Dog, Post Office Box 1029, Clarksville, Arkansas, 72830. Or you can email it to us, and we will show it right here on Sparkle Safety Spot, won't we, Molly? So we um, had a wonderful time today. We'd like to thank... 
We would like to thank everybody at the Little Rock Fire Department. Thank you, Firefighter Bo Hagar. Thank you to Chief Bob Huntrup. Also a big, huge thank you to um, Chief Greg Summers and to Chief Joseph Gray. Thank you for all you do to help support the Keep Kids Fire Safe Foundation. We would also like to thank our sponsor, First Alert. First Alert brings you Sparkle Safety Spot. Thank you to them. And this program is also brought to you by the Keep Kids Fire Safe Foundation. Keep Kids Fire Safe Foundation is dedicated to helping keep children and their families safe. So from Sparkles Clubhouse, this is Dana along with my good friend Molly, the fire safety dog. Molly, can you wave at everybody? Let's wave. 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 Can you wave? Come on, wave. Can you say goodbye? I'll take anything. Here, can you wave? There we go. Good girl. Stay safe, everybody. Have a great week, and we'll see you right back here next week. Take care. Be safe. To learn more, visit firesafetyrocks.com. Safety Spot is brought to you by First Alert and Keep Kids Fire Safe. Keep Kids Fire Safe is dedicated to helping keep children and their families safe.